Everyone loves beaver. What beaver? It's the beaver in Waterloo. <clears throat> so it's a computer competition for kids, but there's no requirement for coding. It's about the reasoning, the logic reasoning, not about the coding. Okay, let's go there. So, bring up a web browser and the search Waterloo Beaver. So Beaver Computing Challenge, C-E-M-C, -E University of Waterloo, let's see. So this is the famous website uh, for kids education. There's math competition and the computer coding competition. And that's Beaver is one of the computer contests. So this is where we are interested in past con past contests. You can find all the beaver tests for in the history so here is past the content the solution and the result that's good we have solutions and there will be very very detailed explanation for every single problem so this part is Gauss is for mathematics you see, we have grade 7, grade 8. So, those are for mathematics. Only here, scroll down. Canadian team. Beaver here, Beaver computing challenges. You see, we have grades 5 or 6, 7 or 8, 9 or 10. So all this in this group here, Beaver, there's no coding. It's just multiple selection uh, problems. The format is quite standard. Each test uh, takes 45 minutes. And uh, there are 12 problems in three groups. So group A, uh, it's a simple one. Group two, the median, and the group group A, B, C. Group C is the hardest. So each group contains four problems. And the, after the beaver, below that, those. If you want like coding, for example, Java or Python, you can you can try those problems. But here today. Let's introduce Beaver only. So let's take a look of this one. Beaver contest for grade five and six, 2018. Hello, this is our lovely, cute Beaver. So grade five or six questions. So my suggestion is you can bring up, for example, a text edit, like text edit. Yeah, and put it on one side here and uh, make 
the browser smaller so you can, we can put the answer here right for example there's uh, one two three four group part a and the part b one two three four and part three one two three four and you put your answer like this, right? B, for example, B, and uh, here is like D, yeah. So, yeah, part A. So you have to do fast, as fast as you can, because we, so you have more time for the, the part three, the hardest part. So for example, here is the story. In each question, there's a title, and the story and the question itself and the here is the multiple selection multiple option so for example if you agree with five you put a B here right for problem one yeah and uh, every problem is very interesting so here is Something about the, the yeah, color blocks. Okay, what about this? Wow, this is a robot. Yeah, and the garden. Part B. Oh, now it's getting harder and harder. So, yeah. So now you have a uh, impression, right? You have some, you get familiar with the format of the problem and there are many, you can, yeah. When you have time, you can try the beaver. Yeah, every year, there's only one beaver test. So what's this part is is it part three already? Oh yeah, part three. So the problems might be trickier. Yeah, and uh, longer the problem. The story is longer, and uh, the pro the question is harder. This is the last one. So, um. Okay, let's take another example. For example, oh, the earliest is 2017. Let's try to take a look at this one. Yeah, same front page and the same 12. Pro, uh, no, sorry, the number of problem is same, not the question itself. Okay, of course, yeah. Part B. So I want to show. You, oh, here is a, a maze problem, right? Yeah, and uh, oh, match sticks. Okay, so the format is different. Yeah, this one is fun. So I'll show you some like a uh, convenient way to do, for example, this problem. So we can make a string copy of this guy here. For example, you wanted to. Now we can bring up another window of text edit. And you can paste it here. And uh, now we can mark, right? So sometimes this is convenient. We can change its color here. Let's use green. So, for example, you wanted to. Oh! Yeah, you want to make some drawing, right? 
as the supporting line for example yeah you can do that right for example yeah it helps the problem solving and the cancel don't save yeah now let's delete that so this one yeah actually you don't need uh, a help place like that but the last problem as far as I know we do need yeah this one this one without something like that is very hard to yeah you don't want to draw this thing right on on the paper it takes it takes too much time so a convenient way is we can make a copy of this guy here because we need to do some calculation for this one so my suggestion is you can do that and now bring up the markup so you can do something like that so for example after you calculate the one this one you can make a mark that right this is used and this is used okay then you, you won't be confused with like what you already count and what you haven't yet, right? And you can make a different mark there. So don't forget we have these convenient uh, tools like that, right? For example, you can make marks like that. Yeah, so this is text edit text edit right so text edit text edit yeah now after you finish right after you finish we can check the answer and the read the detailed explanation of each problem here for example, this guy, you see, solution, solution for the beaver test in 2017. Let's take a look of that. That's so valuable education resource. Don't miss it. Try to make use, take advantage of it, make use of them. You see, part one. Thanks to the professors in Waterloo, you see? That's the original, the problem. Wow, answer, you see? Answer is a three. And why explanation of answer, of answer. Connection to computer science. So that's the reason why they put this question here because there's a connection to computer science even though we didn't write a, a single line of code but there's a, a connection behind the scene and you see the problem is not from Canada it's from all over the world all over the world this one is Romania and the next one yeah, that's the problem itself. And here is the answer. Oh, this one is Estonia. So, beaver contest, right? Accumulate all the variable, the smart mind, right? Mindset from all over the world. Yeah. Oh, this one is from Canada itself. Okay. So, you see? The details the connection right here is like binary numbers yeah so hopefully um, the takeaway is we have the free education resource there try to use it okay and uh, it helps a lot to your mindset and your ability for reasoning Okay, good luck. See you next time.